Now, before we started taping the show here in front of our fabulous live studio audience, uh, before the animation, before anything, while the audience was sitting around, we asked them to write down a bunch of sentences on pieces of paper. We collected them before the show. Now Brad's going to bring them out, and Julie's going to come out and do this game with me. <laughs> oh, actually, we're going to grab a, just grab a handful, stick them in your pocket. Yeah. We're going to do a scene for you uh, based on your suggestion of an odd form of transportation. Uh, based on an odd form of transportation. An odd form of transportation. Okay, Zeppelin. Zeppelin it is. Uh, we're going to do a scene for you based on the word Zeppelin. And we have the sentences in our pocket that we're going to fill in uh, every once in a while. Whatever you're set. Thank you for coming, Carl. Is this your first ride on a Zeppelin? It is. Beautiful, is it not? Every time I see this scenery, you know what I think? I think, what planet are you from? <laughs> you amaze me with your stupidity. Oh, look! A flock of geese flying straight south. Turn around. The window is behind you. <laughs> what a lovely picture. My mother told me about men like you. What she did said, she say? The game isn't over until the fat lady sings. Oh. <laughs> Let me put on a wig and warm up. Look, I didn't just want a Zeppelin ride. I wanted to talk to you. Really? There's someone I want you to kill for me. The last time I killed someone, it was horrible. What happened? They looked up at me as they died, and with their dying breath, they said, your hair looks nice today. That must have been a while ago. Oh, yes. It was. What happened? Oh, my goodness. Oh. Shake, shake, shake. Oh, my goodness. We must have hit something. Oh, we're going Let me down. Go. No, I don't want to go down in a Zeppelin. That is the worst place. Oh, your eyes. Remain calm. Remain calm, everyone. Those bumps remain calm. I am a real blunt. What is that supposed to mean, bitch? You come right back here and say it to my face. <laughs> Let's see. If I was going to tell you I loved you, how would I put it? Let me put it in a poem. The first line of the poem is this. My mind's a blank. <laughs> My mind is a blank, yet I still go to the bank. Imagine what a stank that is. No one has ever talked so beautifully to me before. Yeah, I'll bet. <laughs> tell me about it. Let me tell you something, my friend. Yes. It's not that serious. What happened to... Gay goats. I'll tell you what happened to gay goats. General Gay Goats was murdered. Oh, my goodness gracious. You killed General Gay Goats, Carl. We've been following you. I did nothing to General Gay Goats. Let me see your papers. Let me read what's on your papers, on your passport. What's that in your pants? <laughs> Never mind the papers. What's that in your pants? We will! We have found the murderer of General Gago! Freeze it right there, Carl! You're under arrest and by the power given to me by the Führer himself! The domain server took a dump! <laughs> Gago is dead! The domain server is dumping all over the place! Not so fast! General Gago! <laughs> you thought I was dead, but I am not! The last time I saw you, I said, can I use your toenail clippers? <laughs> and then you tried to kill him with them. <laughs> You're still under arrest, Carl, for the attempted murder of gay goats. My doctor won't like that! <laughs> I've got no response to that. You? <laughs> Maybe you have a response. I do have a response. You just searched my glove compartment. <laughs> 